Hello everyone, happy Saturday to you all. Uh, it's a fabulous day today. It's raining and I love it and the temperature has dropped slightly and I don't have to worry about Lulu's exams anymore. And the only problem is I feel really, uh, I feel a bit like the antihistamines the other day, a bit tired. We did go out and have a nice dinner last night and then um, my in-laws um, had to go home so we walked home and we sort of stayed out a bit a bit late so maybe that's what tied me out as well now what I, I don't um, really feel like doing a tutorial um, I would like to go on with this uh, project here however I have to cut out all the pages but so what I thought I would but so that's great English um, what I thought I would do oh I've done I'll show you I've done two more so this is the one that I did yesterday you can see I'm a bit of a scatterbrain today, um, and that's that one. And then um, I did this one afterwards, or did I do a bit on the thing? I don't know. Um, who remembers? And then that's the back, and I absolutely love these, and that's inside. And then just um, before, I was trying to get my mojo going, but it's just not happening. Um, I did this one. Now this piece here was a collage piece like these that I made. Um, this one I made a while ago and that's with um, that image is uh, the Odyssey volume one um, and then that paper behind is the new eclectic collage sheets and so I, I put that onto that paper there because I really like that and then that's the back and then inside I haven't done anything yet but I wanted to tell you what I did so maybe um, if some of you are doing these um, or wanting to do them maybe you could prepare your bases and I think I will continue on tomorrow but I can't promise it depends you know how the brain is feeling um, and how much I get prepared because I would like to prepare the things and not waste time doing that on screen so basically I wanted to show you what I did I'll just um, and then we'll get down to business just a second I think it's here okay so what I did was I've just got I did a bit of printing this morning that's about all I was up to and I figured out because I've got um, now I can't do it with my HP printer which is still going even though I've got my Epson I've got an Epson EcoTank um, ET 2600 it's just the basic model um, it's the one where you put the the ink in you don't have cartridges um, so basically I what I do is I right click I select my JPEGs I want to print I right click on them and I print um, click on print and then the little window comes up and you've got options of um, whether you want to print two to a page down the side the right hand side and so I chose um, the single one to a page um, that in well mine's in centimeters it's 20 by 25 centimeters and I also removed like I unchecked the adapt to frame okay um, then I went into options you have a little options thing um, and I chose uh, then printer properties comes up and then more options so there's the first page with the Epson with all the different op things and then there's a little tab that says more options in the middle I chose that one and then I clicked you could see in the middle on the right hand side on my printer on my computer it said zoom to and then you and I wrote and then I chose 86 percent so I actually reduced it 86% and I do believe that this when I fold it cut it and fold it it will be the right size for these because if you look or maybe tight yes because that's the overhang there um, so yes I think these I maybe could have printed them slightly bigger um, so maybe 80 maybe try 87% um, or 88 but I just it's just a bit of trial and error and you'll have to if you having if you're not using a Daphne's diary magazine you might be using an A4 sheet of paper you might be using just a, if you've gotten my straw paper it, well, it's a shame to cover it all up though um, so maybe not straw paper but whatever type of paper it could be a huge book that you folded that you're using um, and I mean if you're using A4 it's going to be a smaller little booklet but still be cute um, so you is it okay if I use all the raspberries with my fridges? Yes. Okay. Ask Daddy to help you. Um, so, um, 
now I've lost my train of thought. So yes, you have to trial and error with the percentage. So yes, and I just printed on um, copy paper because these are going to be the pages in the little books. And then I, what I did was, I figured it out, it went okay for me this time. I printed on the back. So this is a Tracy Fox. Um, with this one, I printed it the full size because when I cut this down, I've got all of that and I can use that for other things. So with those ones, I did... Um, the full page size so maybe um, the reason why I'm telling that's from Screech Owl Studio um, and then I did some from the Graphics Fairy on the reverse side another Tracy Fox this one I reduced it down uh, I not, didn't I just unselected the adapter frame um, because I didn't want to lose if it was like the big size I would have lost some of the pretty things that I wanted from that page and then I just want to show then I also printed some from ephemera vintage garden um, I love those papers and another exciting thing that I did was I printed on some of Jaff's um, ones that didn't have too much color I printed them on straw paper so I think those will be super nice um and then i so what i've done is all of these pages come from a whole lot of different kits so uh yeah i'm telling you this now so that way if you wanted to um sort of work along at the same pace then you could um print them out so um i printed out some of the pretty flowers and then i printed a whole lot with jaffs she has a couple and in the kits that i have there are a couple of pages that are good for um writing on so i, I printed a whole lot of those on the reverse side they were my trials and I've got some more here somewhere that that one as well as Jaffs as well so all of the extra bits off the the um, paper won't go to waste because I'll be able to use those in other projects like for backs of tags and stuff like that so that's where I'm at with with the project um, the medieval mirage design team project so I figured um, if you guys go ahead and if you want to you're keeping up with me and you want to do that then You've got the opportunity to do that today or tomorrow um, and so i'm not going on i might decorate inside here if i feel like it because um, i wanted to do three i don't like just doing one i like to and you see what i do i do i prepare a whole lot like i'll prepare three at a time or you know sometimes more um, if i had more time i'd prepare more and then uh, then i'll work on all the pages together so that's streamlining the process so yeah I, and i really like doing these covers so that's that now today you can see kathleen's page here now when i was on my rant the other day um i don't i think i wasn't um very clear uh, the the comment was on instagram and it was on this post um uh, when i posted kathleen's page and so anyway it's disappeared because i i actually blocked the lady i felt like she didn't deserve to see what i'm doing if that's the way she was going to speak to me and so she's blocked and i don't know whether she removed um the comment or whether instagram removed it because i blocked her but anyway she's gone um so it wasn't on youtube it was on um instagram and i was really surprised i never had any mean people on instagram before so yeah anyway we're over that now um so i pulled this out because um dear mary has sent me two beautiful happy mails and i haven't um I haven't documented her happy mails and so I'm going to do that today and I have a box full of goodies that she sent me to play with and so I thought I'd get on with that because I am feeling tired and I thought well it's a good opportunity to catch up on um, Mary's so I'm just moving my things around and I will and you know what else was getting me today was I had like everything here was just it, the whole table was just covered with stuff and I couldn't I'm going to keep that little notes I took so I could tell you um, this whole table was I couldn't even I didn't even want to come in here like I was just like how am I going to cope with all of this stuff so you would have seen this um, video quite a while ago um, because I think I received it about a month ago if not more time flies but I got some really cool things from Mary and I'm sorry Mary I'm such a slow-mo I really am a slow-mo um, but I wanted to document it a little bit so I thought I'd use this other the reverse side that I had left of uh, Kathleen's page words are eluding me so my you, uh, you may notice this is what I do every single time every single time but it works for me 
I just start with a bit of book page, just whack it down, a bit of book page, just it just really does it for me. So I'm going to glue that down. I might use my nice glue from Choice. So I've already finished one of these and I did finish another Giotto glue stick the other day. Um, now the reason I never put a link for the Giotto glue sticks or anything is because I buy them at the shop not too far from here so I don't have an online link uh, where you can buy them and it's an Italian brand it's a good Italian brand for artistic sort of supplies uh, it's not like Windsor & Newton or anything like that but it is good for kids like all the kids the pencils are very good the kids use the pencils at school and stuff like that um, and the glue is very it's exceptional the glue is amazing so I've got that going there then what so Mary sent me this beautiful notepad not notepad paper pad so I just might have a little flick through here I might flip through like this so it doesn't take me too long and see I could like that and it's quite a thin paper so it's perfect for collaging what I don't I don't know why I don't oh somebody's oh it's Lulu I thought someone was drilling not only do I have the neighbors going I've got Lulu going as well so um I don't know why I don't like this part here is it like can you hear me like doing the the I can, but it doesn't matter. Just Is get on with annoying? it. Oh, well, it's a bit annoying, but get on with it. <laughs> I won't lie. I won't lie. It sounds like a drill. <laughs> I do like... Oh, I pulled out two. Aren't these papers beautiful? You see, this is a good thing that I pulled this out and um, had a look and decided to do this because I had forgotten. <gasps> it's all lovely. Anyway, we won't wait. We won't take too long. Oh, I know what else I was going to do. So let me, I think I might put this one down and not that one. And I'm going to tear it. I think I want to hand tear it. I don't want to use my ruler because I want it to be a little bit more irregular than that. Lovely paper. Let me just show you again in case, because you guys are in the States. Mary's in the States. This is the brand so you can see. Um, if you want to buy it, it's just it's lovely and I think let me tell you how many there are of each one one two Oh, there's heaps of each one like maybe five There's five of each one. No six 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 of each one. Oh There you go. It says it on the front. There you go. Good on you, Rachel Okay, so I'm gonna put that there. I Don't ask me why I don't like that Just don't ask me why I don't know couldn't tell you the answer I just don't like it okay and the struggle is real it really is as usual I have started a project and I have no way idea which direction it's going to go I've got no idea what I'm going to put on the page I, I do know it's going to be Mary's stuff I, I can tell you that that's about it really now, I had put this down. I thought, look at this beautiful napkin. I forgot that Mary sent me napkins. And I thought, I might put this... Oh, no. I left my sticky tape in the other room, didn't I? Oh, well, I'll have to wing it getting the, the layers off, won't I? Can't go and get my... Oh, no. And I promised Sherry I'd show her the, the spray, the fixative spray that I use on my images. Well, I might have to... Um, I forgot that too, it's out there and I kept reminding myself before I came and did the video to remember the fixative spray. I have no sticky tape in here. I don't. I've got, oh, I know what I've got. I've got a double-sided sticky tape. That might work. This one. Let me see. No. Nah. Does not like that one. Oh, got it got that layer let me see if I can get this other layer otherwise I can turn it over can't I so let me see what did I get here what did I get I got one that's one we need another one oh and some of it stayed on cheeky monkey oh I got it I think I got it. Yep. Well, that was lucky that I remembered I had that because we could have been here until tomorrow trying to take off the three layers. Perfect. So, how about a little bit of that? So I've just put that... I could have put it in my bin right there, but I'll put it in there because it was bigger. 
and I'm just going to grab a wet one because I'm going to get sticky fingers regardless of what I do. Oh, I know what else I'd like to put in on this page is um, some of my my green recycled paper. So let me just um, just trying to see. It doesn't really have a direction, I don't think. I just want a piece of it. How'd you go? Good. She's made herself a smoothie. Oops, pulled too much off. Okay, very pretty. And I'm going to put that there. Yes, I am. I like that. Will I put it down here? I think I might like it. Oh, I think I like it more down there. And I could have a tiny bit up there of something. Maybe that one. How about that? So let's get some glue down happening down here. I haven't even checked if I'm on screen or not. Goodness knows what's happening. Who knows? I want to bother oh maybe I might like just to put a little piece of oh look here's some brown paper in here as well this is all Mary's box with all her bits and pieces what about a piece of brown paper I might leave the brown oh I like that with the washi on it there we go good one bring a little bit of brown paper bag somewhere else yeah yes 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 get some glue on there and I think I'll get some glue onto the washi as well just in case it's pretty sticky but you wouldn't like it to come off Gosh, I love today. It's we very rarely get rain in the summertime here. Very rarely. And this is just fabulous. I love it. Stormy and dark and yummy. Okay, so that's great. I don't feel guilty. I'm gonna have a sip of coffee, just a second. We have a new system, we take the microphone off. Oh, now I did get this lovely See, I got this lovely doily from from um, Mary that was folded like so. I think I would like to put that down somewhere, even up there, maybe up there. I'm not going to commit to anything until I kind of decide, otherwise I'll sort of mess up the page. So I kind of would like that there. And it had these lovely little taggy sort of things um, that Mary made. So I think these need to go. Aren't they precious? They're just gorgeous. Really lovely. Just love it. So I'll just put those there. So um, I also had this, but I don't think this colour is going to go with my theme. Although I could, these are post-its, I could um, trim around the flower. So we won't say no to that. Um, I'm probably not going to use the napkins. So I'll put the napkins aside because they need to go on my napkin box. And I've got my brown paper there. There's so many goodies in this box, I can't tell you. Um, and I really have to decide. There's these lovely, I think I'll keep those for something else. 
and then all of her beautiful wools that she sent me that she hand dyed she the cat's mother I mean Mary and then a lovely bat well, I could put the bag in there couldn't I it's very shiny don't know if I'm a bag person so I'll put that aside oh got these lovely um, Christmas ones well they will be on to Christmas soon won't we oh my word I can't believe we'll be on to Christmas soon that's an incredible thought I'm going to keep some of these um, notes that she sent me well I put those over there now you'll just I might I'll have to put an R sticker there and then there's this pretty paper but I might keep those things to use and then there's some lovely look at these washies oh on cards fabulous blessing just trying to see what else of oh, that beautiful vintage um, thingy majiggy I can't the words word is eluding me right now And then I got these beautiful Tim Holtz. Aren't they divine? Love those. I'm going to hoard those for a little while. It's that one. I'm just pulling it all out. I thought I was organized, but really I'm not. Some birds. Okay, I was just trying to see what sorts of things I might like to use for a pocket. And just let me see these. So for example, these postcards are pretty cool but no put that paper back in for a second oh yeah so there was that doily but Mary also gave me these doilies that are super pretty very intricate they are I think that's one I was thinking maybe a piece would be nice Maybe a whole piece there and it will get it will be covered up a little bit but I think I really like that so I'm just going to smush a whole lot of glue everywhere it's really just um, getting many different things onto the page so that you can remember I also do like to have oh, I forgot to use my um, recycled paper it doesn't matter Ooh, sticky I um, don't know where the, where the silly card is where's it gone where has it gone? I mean, you know, there's stuff everywhere. I'll use one of Mary's. I'll use this end of it. Get some glue under there. Oh, this is a playing card. No. No, it seems plastic. I don't know. There we go. okay I think I will commit to that I can write there and then I think I'm going to make some sort of pocket some sort one of those I think I could glue here like so because I don't want to cover it all up but I might glue that there and then that will go there so why don't we finish this now how am I going to do this I need to put some glue and I think I might have to use the PVA glue here so first of all I need to glue this bit I don't want to get too much because there's holes it'll seep through Just so it vaguely sticks down put a little bit there okay and then oh is not easy to do and that's like that so that's my little pocket I need to get some more glue up here put the lid on I have to like there's about a third in there but um, it takes a while to come down if I don't keep it upside down and then I need to put I'll put a whole lot of glue there and just a little bit there so I can do that here I 
Okay. So that's good. That's sticking down. Perfect. And then I wanted to glue this. Now, I've never glued this glassine bag down. I wonder if double-sided tape would hold it. Probably not as well. Probably eventually pop up. So I think I might have to put a little bit of this around it. It'll probably crinkle, but it'll be underneath anyway, so it doesn't matter. What I might do, <coughs> excuse me, is use some of this lovely washi tape. And just open this. Yep, that's good. And then I might put, that's all good. I think I might put something over there. Let me see this other one. Cute bunnies. Let's put the bunny one. next now put now somewhere gorgeous mm. I'm probably going to put a pocket somewhere another one so where do I want to put the R? I'll just put it there. Okay. So that's all being used. Coffee time again. Okay, so I've got these lovely things here. That one can slide a little bit big. I think these were they were all in here. I think I would like that one to I think I would like to stick that one on or stick it on somewhere. And I'd attach that so it doesn't keep moving all the time. So I'll just decide that in a minute. And then I also have this beauty here that I really like. Could stick her there. Oh, that's my book pad. And then there's all these. Oh, yes, they're good. I'll use those. Oh, that's a big glassine bag. I'll stick that down. What I'll do is I'm going to move this on to the other side. Gorgeous. Look at that gorgeous paper. Oh, but it's going to be sideways. Maybe I'll stick that there. glue this down there perfect I could have made it a double pocket actually now that I think of it doesn't matter I put glue everywhere now Right. 
Okay, and I think I'll take that off. And put that here. Beautiful washi tape. Okay, and then I'm going to decorate this. Get that butterfly out. I'm going to use some book page. Just throw that over there. Or maybe I'll use some old letter. I think I'd like some old letter. Yes, super pretty page. Reminds me of Mary really reminds me of Mary this page okay that's that and then oh, I could have a bit of this paper oh I've got a piece of this flying around why don't I put some of that there And then that, oh, let's have a look at this. Might use a little piece of these to possibly this one. Gosh, they're nice, they're really thick. Okay, where did all those stickers go? Here we go. Let's have a look. Love that. Oh yes, that's pretty. Or oh, there was this um, butterfly here. Oh, that butterfly might be nice there. Okay, so I'm going to stick that down there. Am I even mm -hmm. videoing? Yes, I am, and you can see me good. And I know I'm not a chatterbox today, just tired. I'll probably be a chatterbox again tomorrow. Could be the weather too, as much as I like it, it's sort of weather that makes you feel a bit um, maybe super relaxed and tired. I'm going to put the butterfly there. Maybe I like that one. No, that one. I think the other one's too big. Okay. And then... I was thinking I might put a bit of, um, I might, I'll just see what it looks like, a bit of, that might not be big enough. Oh yes, a bit of book page or something there. It's kind of funny. Nope. I think I'll just stick the flowers down all by themselves. I'm not using everything, just a little bit. Okay. 
that's that one I like that then I'll have to decide what to put in the pocket that's that I need to stick some I did because I actually didn't glue that down I just stuck it back on with the washi tape where's my lid put that upside down otherwise it'll take us forever to get the glue that one has to dry and now I need to decorate this one Isn't this fun? I know I've still got a few ones, a few that I received previously that I still haven't done a page for. I'll get there, I'll get there, I'll get it done. And where did that piece of... Yep, I like that. I don't care if it goes sideways. No. And then, let's just close that. That's cool. And then I could have not that one. Put that one there. there close that that's all right and then I can need to put something on there I think but not too big let me just see this one and here's another one Oh, that's too big, that one. Put that one there. Ah, I nearly said these are the Alibaba stickers. I mean the AliExpress, not the Alibaba. I always want to say Alibaba. Okay like that that's that and then what did I see what else did I see that I like this do you like that put that there got plenty of space to write put that there and I was thinking I might put that there and I'm going to write who it came from and the date and I'm going to use the PVA because this is very stiff cardboard or cardstock and I want it to stick down well okay so that's that may have to sort of hold it down a little bit do like it I think this page is coming together and if you knew Mary she's very sweet and lovely and kind and well most people are like that too but she's I don't know she seems like a gentle soul um, so this sort of reminds me of her it's soft and pretty and I'm just going to glue this one now. Now these are those. I think these are the Tim. Tim. I was going to say the Tim stocks. The, the, I can, can you tell? That's why I'm not speaking. That is why I'm not speaking. Everything's coming out backwards. Um, Tim Holtz. Tim Holtz die cuts. They are. Love it. I really do like this page got a representation of most things I mean I do get the, all those lovely walls as well um, 
so um, but I'm not putting those in um, these it's just so pretty okay and I did have these but I used them all so it's nice to did you hear the thunder it's nice to um, to have them you know like one that I'm keeping I might like this butterfly down here no I don't like that butterfly down there what about the mushrooms I kind of like the mushrooms or is, am I making my page too busy now I think I'm going to slip these in I think I'll put them in this glassine bag because I think they'll fit in there perfectly and they do because I'm going to hang on to them for a bit slip those in there in they go and this one don't mind that one down there but anyway I can always decide at a later date and I didn't cut out one of those that's got my scrap basket and I'm going to put those in there and then I had where were those other ones from Mary here this one for the moment I'm actually going just going to put that it's going to be very bulky though it's got the little bead on it oh it's pouring yay like it um, and then there's those put those in the box so I can't obviously put everything in my thing and I did want to keep some of these so I'm going to take that out put that in the box for the moment and I've got Mary's letter I'll have to get that and put that in there too and then I've got these these can all go here and I'll sort those out in my regular boxes where I put all the things that I use and there's some more messages from Mary pretty washi tape just slip those in there as well and that is Mary's page I just have to write on it and then it's done I'm not going to use that keeping oh there's my thing it was under everything okay so that is my page for today that is it as you can see here and I've got all this space I'm going to write on it you'll see that next time and put all those things I just have to get Mary's letter and that is done and that's that's Kathleen's beautiful page love it perfect so now I've used both sides of that big sheet so thank you for watching um, and I will be back tomorrow bye